go. And welcome. I'm Amanda Faye. That is Matthias. Hey. Oh, that was <laughs> that was a weird angle. <laughs> <laughs> and today is Team Edge Day. If you can tell by his shirt. Not my shirt. No, you're not. You're not wearing Team Edge clothing. No, because I'm not allowed in Team Edge. Space. You're not. What are you gonna do though today? What What you got planned for today, girl? I actually have an ultrasound appointment to go to, which I'm excited. Hopefully they'll give me some pictures. Cause last time I went to them, they just like didn't even let me see anything. It was really annoying. I was very frustrated. <laughs> well, no, cause the last time I went, it was the actual doctor who did it, and I was like irritated. But this time it's the radiologist, so I'm sure she's probably gonna give me some pictures and like let me see stuff and tell me more stuff about. Everything that's going on because the doctor was like in and out in like two seconds But I had to wait an hour and a half to see this guy after my appointment time I was not very happy, but hopefully today will be a better day than that Other than that, I feel like I don't really have anything else planned today Just a lot of like little stuff around the house But uh, that's really exciting for me. Hopefully um, I don't know maybe Sarah and the girls will come over and be more exciting later but Team Edge is just filming. I don't know what they're filming. Maybe it's gonna be exciting. Maybe Matthias will take you on his journey. Yes! <laughs> right now he's just trying to get the vlog up, I think. Yes! <laughs> so I'm gonna let him do that. I still have a whole bottle of water to drink in about five minutes. <sighs> yes! So it's gonna be a tough feat to drink 17 ounces in about 10 minutes. Don't blow your bladder! <laughs> <laughs> they make you hold it for an hour! <laughs> Team Edge Day today, and that means we're shooting challenges, and challenges happen to be drone hunting! <laughs> so we're literally bought the cheapest yeah, drones yeah, we could joking. accurately fly, and we're going to shoot them out of the sky with Zingbos. Zing, I think that's gonna be fun, to be honest with you. And I'm gonna win. Then we're also shooting down. The big drone? Big drone. The big drone. The big drone. <laughs> dope, dope. I'm looking forward to winning all these challenges today, guys. Ha! So we went to the park, tried to do the drone hunting challenge, and that did not work at all. <laughs> um, we just couldn't, we, so we were doing a testing phase to see if we could even hit the drone. Couldn't do it. Um, the Zingbos are awesome, but the drone can move a lot quicker than like what you anticipate with the bow, so it just doesn't work out. It'd be much better if we were doing maybe paintball, like you said. Paintball would work. The next thing we've got is giant Jenga, which is super funny because I just watched uh, Pointless Blog, uh, Zo Zoe's boyfriend, um, just do this challenge. Oh, really? Yeah. That's funny. Isn't that funny? So, hey, maybe it'll be trending now. Maybe. <laughs> Alright, before we film that, because one of the uh, hoverboards is dead, we're going to film a top ramen challenge. And I'm going to win because I have the best taste buds. But we also got something to make the sound Dude, I better. I won the last challenge. <laughs> what? Last challenge. <laughs> Don't tell them. You can't so, tell them. So the light's good on here? Yeah, the light's much better on here because this thing was blocking it. But this thing isolates the microphone so it doesn't get uh, sound coming in through the back of the microphone because microphone patterns pick up sound in different ways. This is directional which means it picks up sound in front of it and slightly behind it. Um, so if we knock out the, so the sound behind it, hopefully we get much better sound. So how does it look? Everything's not too dark? Everything's in focus? Uh, everything's, everything's good. Yeah, everything's, everything's good. The issue being is like people, why don't you just use the technique that you used last time, you know, like with my main channel videos where you get a mic up close and personal. It's because you have to sync it. You have to sync and that's a huge process and, and it's time consuming. People. It's just syncing audio is the best option here. Oop, the best option here is to go directly into the camera like we're doing that. That's the best option. It's the most, it's the most efficient option because it just automatically synced when you get it off the camera. Just finished with the noodle challenge. Turns out Brian and J J Fred are just gonna finish this off for lunch. Lunch time! Seriously. Your wife brought you lunch. Well, yeah, he, he likes he likes this nasty noodle stuff more than he likes not his. All of them. I like the shrimp stuff. Yeah. The, shrimp the cheddar stuff cheese one looks disgusting. Yeah, yeah. the shrimp one is really good. Cool. Excuse me, we're vlogging here. Noodles for you. All right, lunch time. <laughs> we're currently in the middle of filming the hoverboard Jenga challenge, and it's way it's way more fun than I expected. <laughs> regular regular Jenga is like eh, it's okay, but this is like so much more fun. I guess because it's more active. It's like way more active. 
And the, the, the rules of falling off the hoverboard are cool too. They're cool, yeah. Now get back to work, build it. You're part of this knockdown process. You got to <laughs> Okay, just for that epic fail. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I don't want to give it away. <laughs> All right, Brian's gonna try to ride these two at a time. I don't think it's possible. They freak out. They they jitter and freak out. Put enough weight on them. Okay, do it. Just do it, Brian. I can't wait for him. I got it. I got it. Look at you. You got it. You're you're not actually moving the front one though. Power yourself only by the front one. <laughs> <laughs> oh! I'm gonna knock stuff over. Oh, I got it. Don't worry about it. Hold on. Oh, jeez. Oh, <laughs> You're a car. Well, this is much less exciting than I thought it was gonna be. Well, there's still too much stuff in my way. Oh, right. I have made it with like five minutes to spare and. I don't really think there's gonna be much that I can record while I'm in there, but I'll let you guys know how it goes because there's like signs all over the place, no recording, no live streaming, which I thought that was really funny. So, all right, I'm gonna get going and hopefully it all goes well. Okay, I finished up at the radiologist ultrasound and it only took like 10 minutes, which is awesome. I was literally in there like sign, you know, I could check in or whatever for 15 minutes. So, um, everything looks good. She's measuring, I guess, a day ahead. She's, I guess, a, a little bit bigger than I thought. Um, and I got to see her face and her mouth moving. And it was just so freaky because when you see the ultrasound, you kind of just see like the bone sockets of everything. So it kind of looks like a skull. Uh, because like the skin isn't it's kind of still translucent and it's just it's kind of funny. I don't know. I'll show you some pictures um, It's just like so funny, but she's head down which is great because that's the position you want the baby to be in but um, Just the last couple of days she has been I wasn't sure what was kicking me I wasn't sure if it was her feet or her hands, but it's definitely her feet She's been kicking me under my ribs, and she's been very 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 um, active so that's just a new sensation that has been weird it kind of feels like she, her foot is like hooking under my rib and kind of like sitting there so it's kind of uncomfortable I'm just like what are you doing girlfriend uh, it's hilarious so here is um, like a picture of her face you're gonna have to I had to like squint a little bit to kind of figure out what I was looking at because um, it kind of looks like a big teddy bear which is funny so let me see if I can find a good one the ultrasound person gave me five pictures to look at. I think this is the best one showing off of her face. Like here's her eyes and her nose and her little mouth and I got to see her mouth moving and um and I got to see her like swallowing and stuff and these are her hands and she was like having her hands like in front of her face a little bit. Here's another one you can see like her eyes her eyelid is right there it's so crazy. I don't know I just think she kind of looks like a little spider monkey. Now it looks like she's got pretty big lips, so I think she's getting that from me. So those are her lips and her little nose. Such a cute eye! Super excited to meet her and to see what she actually is going to be like. I just, it's kind of crazy to me that like, since I'm 30 weeks exactly today, it's kind of weird to me that like she could be here in like 7 to 10 weeks, which is weird. It's like so soon. <laughs> it's only like a month and a half. You know, it's two months away. I don't know. It's crazy. Crazy! Ouch. <laughs> so I decided that I wanted to work in Luna's room right now. Just because. Um, and uh, I hung those two things up there. And then I hung one thing over here. Um, and then I realized I think I need Matthias' help because I need to hang something evenly. Or to hang two things and I have to make sure they're even. So I required a bit of help because I'm not. This that, is not even. I'm not that good at it. This is not even like a good level. I know. I tried to use that last time, and I was like, "Is are my eyes just off or what?" Well, this one right here isn't level. But the top one is. How weird. Yeah, the top one seem appears to be somewhat accurate. Do you need a pencil? Yeah. Here you go. I'm not a handy person. That's okay. 
I really wish I was. I can hang things singly. Okay, so. <clears throat> okay, what do we need to do next? I don't know where you, I don't know where you, you're looking to hang it. You dig? Uh, yes, that's so, a very good question. Yeah, I mean, yeah, jump the gun just a <laughs> tad, my love. Is that what you were trying to do? Yes, does that work? Well, I mean, you hung it wrong the first time. She was, you were hanging it, you hung it like this. Oh, I was like, something's not there's right. A, there's a hook that you missed. I know. <laughs> I was like, I didn't measure off, I just hung it up wrong. Okay, so now I'm just wanna see how close you can get this guy to. How close? Um, that's about good. Are okay. you a little farther? Oh, uh, farther away? Yeah, that's good. Are you vlogging this? <laughs> yeah. You think people wanna watch me hang a <laughs> shelf? Oh, jeez. I didn't realize it was still on. So what do you think? Uh, now there's You like it? You just gotta put earthquake wax on it. Yeah, you do you want wanna out. get some while you're at Lowe's? Well, I'm at Home Depot. Oh, Home, I will Home do that, Depot. My love. I will do that. All right, ta ta. <laughs> I guess um, the guys are gonna go to Home Depot and get a shed for Team Edge. Um, so that sounds like fun. <laughs> uh, and while they're doing that, I think I'm gonna bake some cookies for tonight because we're actually going over to the Crazy Cruise place for dinner. And I'm really excited about what I'm gonna bake tonight. And I think you guys are gonna be really kind of excited too because it's kind of like a fun little cookie. Because I didn't know what to make. I, I always wanna make cake, but cake's a little heavy and I don't think people want cake all the time like I do. Lately, all I've been craving is cake. <laughs> but I haven't given in to that. But I've been eating too much sugar. So bad, oh, so bad. Oh, I'm just annoyed with myself very much. Um, so I think I'm just gonna clean up around here, um, hang a couple of more things, figure out where I'm gonna put some stuff. Um, I don't know, I just kinda wanted to work in here. Maybe it's the nesting mode finally coming out because I have a little bit of energy, so. Not sure what else to do in this room. I just kind of put away some stuff, picked up some trash, kind of just organized a little um, but I did hang this from, I think it's Mike and Katrina. Yes, Mike and Katrina. I did hang that above. Okay, now I gotta make sure it's straight. I hung it above this chair. I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep this chair or get like a rocker, but there's gonna be some pretty curtains right here. And I just thought it would look cute for pictures or whatever if I'm ever sitting there with her or if anybody else is sitting there. It's just gonna look so beautiful in my mind. In my mind is gonna look beautiful. I don't know if you can picture how beautiful it's gonna be because you're not in my mind. So right now I'm gonna clean up all these tools, go put them away, and then go downstairs and make some cookies. I really feel like I should be editing my video instead of baking cookies, but I'm trying to relax and rest, and this is what makes me feel relaxed, which is probably not good for anybody's health because it's just sugar, but I don't know, I like baking in because I don't want to just bake for me and Matthias um, because one, we don't need it, and two, I don't know, we just don't need it. But since we're going and we're hanging out with a bunch of people, I guess it's fun to just bring stuff and just ha see everybody else eat it. I don't know, because <laughs> I usually don't eat what I bake just because I have more fun baking it than I do actually eating it. So. Yes, but I will get a video out this Sunday. I promise you guys, because I think I'm gonna start doing one video a week on my main channel instead of two, because I don't, I can't really handle two anymore. So I think one video it is, and sometimes I feel like I can't even handle one video, but I'm definitely gonna try. So I'm gonna maybe take a nap and try and get as much sleep at night as I can, but it's so difficult. It's really hard to sleep now. It's very frustrating, because I'm uncomfortable a lot of the time, and I get a lot of Braxton Hicks contractions at night, especially when I'm laying down, because you're not allowed to lay on your back. So you can only lay on your sides, and, that, and on my right side, I get way too many. So I feel like I can only lie on my left side. But when you lay on your sides for a few hours at a time, it's like, okay, you have to roll over. So it's just a bunch of nonsense. So I find that I actually sleep better during the day with naps than I do at night, so. All right, what are we doing now, boys? Are we going over to your place for dinner? Yes. Oh yeah, dinner, what time's that at? We're having a pizza, deep fried pizza. Oh! You're lying though. Why? 
Have you ever had deep fried pizza? Yeah, I had it like a week ago. Did you really? Oh, you mean deep dish? Oh, in Idaho? No, I had it I, the day I came back from Idaho, Azim's birthday party. Deep fried pizza, I made that up. They actually make that? No, it's deep dish pizza. Oh, I said deep fried. Oh, so you just made it all up? Yeah. <laughs> Great, I'm gonna get over there and we're gonna have like eggplant. Uh, no, she says she's making a s squash s something. <laughs> Are you kidding? That's what eggplant is. Eggplant is a squash. I didn't know that. Wait, eggplant is a squash? Okay. Isn't pumpkin a squash too? Yes! Yes! <laughs> what you working on? What you working on? Oh, melted. Oops. Uh, cookies. <laughs> I didn't think about that. You look really cute, by the way. Let's see the belly bump. Oh, I'm 30 weeks today. 30 week belly bump update, guys. 30 week belly bump, 30 week belly bump, 30 week belly bump, you missed it. What kind of cookies are you making? Those ones, cinnamon roll sugar cookies. Cinnamon roll sugar cookies, that looks amazing. I can't wait to eat them all before we even bring them over to Brian's house. Yes, I'm excited. So we're all gonna go over to Brian's place, eat all that food, and then come back. Squash, right? Yeah, squash. I don't think so, bro. Bratwurst. I don't think so. Oh, we gotta take off the AC. Okay, these are starting to look really amazing, Amanda. <laughs> these are I just finished the last, rolling the last one, so what you do is you kind of roll it into a snake, and then you roll it into the cinnamon sugar, and then you roll it into a cinnamon roll. It's a lot of rolling. So, I don't know, they look really cute. Yeah, they really do. <laughs> a little cinnamon rolls. I know, I'm excited. I'm gonna pop them in So the what are they exactly, snickerdoodles? Um, I think so. The recipe that I'm using, I'm not, I didn't have enough time to look at my snickerdoodle recipe and compare it, but I think it's pretty much just a snickerdoodle. <gasps> what if they taste bad? They look a little different. I mean, they are a little different because there's like some different ingredients in it, but um, I think overall they should be good. That's all you're making? That's Brian's dessert. I'm sure Sarah's not going to let Brian have too many. That's, that seriously, that's all you're making? Yeah, I'm not making a lot. That's one cookie per person. And there's 12 cookies. Joey's not gonna have any. The girls might have half of one. Um, Sarah might have one. That's not enough cookies. <laughs> it's plenty of cookies. <laughs> look at look how many look how many cookies she made. It's a dozen cookies. Looks good to me. Come on, dude. They look like little dookies. <laughs> <laughs> hey, get out of here! Look at them. They're cute. <laughs> no, maybe if they're taller, they'd look more well, like a dookie. They're gonna puff up, and then they're gonna have icing on them. Yeah. Look good to me. Okay, here's what they look like with the glaze. Oh, hey, handsome. <laughs> How you doing? They, those look good. I but hope they taste see, good. The fact that there's not enough now presents a big problem. The big problem is that I can't taste one before. Yeah, taste one. No, I just brushed my teeth. Oh, how dare you. But they smell. Do they? They're still warm. <laughs> They're still warm. I'm trying to get them to cool as quickly as possible, so. All right, you ready to go? I'm ready, let's do it. All right. All right, dinner's ready. Look at this. Look how beautiful this is. Look at all that good food. Oh my gosh. What are you doing? You're gonna get lightheaded, girl. Mm -hmm. You got watermelon, huh? You like that watermelon. I love it. Good stuff, huh? But I'm always too impatient to buy watermelon because we let it like ripen. This one I bought today. What? At Trader Joe's. <laughs> I was like, this is plenty of cookies. Joey just said so. Cookie dookie. Because Joey thinks that you should have one cookie and everyone else wants to Yeah, that's true. The serving size is one cookie. Yeah. I'll take the smallest. You don't get one. Yeah, I'm gonna she eat one if there's leftovers. I don't either. <laughs> I was like, all right guys, um, now Amanda made dessert. <laughs> everyone can have a half a cookie. <laughs> <laughs> there's always too many left <laughs> over and then everybody's like, I don't wanna, I don't wanna I take them home. home. I don't wanna yeah. take them home. Yeah, that ever happens. Yes! Because people, people are always like trying to watch their weight, uh, not eat bad. Uh, I watch my weight. I watch my weight go up. I watch my yeah. weight balloon. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> it's not fun. I watch my weight balloon. Can we try them? Hey, Matthias, watch. Try them. Who are you? That was Ariana. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Don't blame her. She's gonna be upset with you. It's like all over She's head. like my marker. <laughs> Can you tell me about your boo-boo? Like on your arm, I saw it. <laughs> Ouchie! It hurt arm. I got Same thing, we are on the slide together. You got it on the slide? You went down too fast it, or something? No, 
It's because we went together, but it was called a speed slide. Oh. They said you couldn't go together. <laughs> you didn't listen. We didn't know we could go together. The first. Well, that's why. And then, this is what happens when you don't read oh, signs. Yeah. Read signage, people. It was too fast. It was so fast because like really? the heavier you are, the faster you are. Okay, what is this place? Billy, Billy Bees. Bees. Where is it? Yeah, how do I get there? In the mall? Is that it's it's not adults in the mall, do outside. it? You can go with adults. Weird. Yeah, you don't go by yourself because you look pretty weird. Yeah, it's full. Oh, wow. It's hard to find it. Oh, Aunt Amanda said you could have that. Get it. Okay, hey, try oh, it and tell it. me what hey. you think. He, Matthias, hey. he Yummy! Just, hey. Do you like it? Yummy. <laughs> How come you say yummy before you actually taste it? <laughs> she goes like this? Yeah. I think she inhales some of the like mm -hmm. fumes. Maybe, yeah, yummy. maybe maybe like the, the kids like sense is super powerful compared, Probably, you know, because they're like, they're younger. Yeah. You know, it doesn't all die off. taste buds off, so. That's true, you oh, have. Spicy food? <laughs> Just hot food. Hot food. I just like everything really, really hot and really, really spicy. You know, like my dad. He yeah. Likes everything so hot. He likes it to I burn him, and it. then he starts eating. Yeah. It's like, like this is he, he literally spicy. gets his meal, and he's he like. Ha, it's ha, cold. Ha, ha. Usually when they get cold, it's like coffee. He's watching this, by the way. It's like warm for him. One time we like we had a hot cocoa, and we both got the same hot cocoa, and I was like, "Oh, that's hot." He's like, "That's not hot." <laughs> he makes that face. <laughs> He's like drinking hot tea. <laughs> it's painful. All right, I'm gonna try it. How do you cook grass? Smells like cinnamon. <laughs> hey, this no, no, like is not affecting that at all. That was just a straight up mess up. I don't know. I was like, how many you had? I just talk like that all the time. Trust me, like half of the, half of the edits that you guys see in the vlog <laughs> is just me messing up talking and then trying over. <laughs> Anytime you ever see an edit, see? Yeah. <laughs> it's very soft in the middle. Cinnamony. Yeah, cinnamon That's good. The middle but I think I like your your recipe much better. Yeah, your snickerdoodle recipe much better. I love snickerdoodles. Yeah, you know what? I do these, like snickerdoodles. These better. aren't as flavorful as yours. Yeah, well, I just I didn't have time to switch up. She tried. She just hit her face and then. Plus, when you. Yeah, it's okay. Kind of bland. Yeah, a little bland, yeah. But it's soft and that's good. So, we're back home and the cookies did not turn out that great. They did, they looked great, but they didn't taste that great. I mean, it, it just wasn't a good recipe. It wasn't a good recipe. It's not on your cooking, you know? You, you, you did it like perfectly how the recipe said. It's just bad recipe. Yeah, the recipe wasn't great. If I was gonna make them again, I'd just use my snickerdoodle recipe. Yeah, use your recipe. <laughs> I don't know why you didn't do that to begin with. Because I just wanted to test out another recipe. Well, you don't test it out on people. You test it out on yourself. But who do you test it out on? I don't want to waste all the ingredients just on myself. 12 cookies, 12 small cookies. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess it's good that it, um, they weren't good, so people didn't eat them, so they didn't feel guilty about eating them. <laughs> so, really, it was my secret plan all along. Yeah. <laughs> I, made, I made the joke. I made the joke that like there weren't enough cookies, and then there were like eight cookies left because no, no one was touching them. That's funny. <laughs> <laughs> That's irony. And Bella was like, there's cookies left, I eat them! Yeah, she had no problem eating them. No, she didn't. <laughs> Everyone else was like... <laughs> I wasn't offended at all, it just... It well, there, that... there's nothing that you... There's nothing that you did wrong. Yeah. Well, I mean, you chose a bad recipe. I did. I guess you did that. Oops. <laughs> it looked good on Pinterest, but Pinterest is very deceiving. Well, see, the issue is is that sometimes people cook things just to make them look good. Yeah. Not to make them taste good. Like, in my opinion, I don't care what it looks like as long as it tastes good. It could look like a pile of poop, which it almost looked like. But it's got to taste good, not like a pile of poop. Ta-da! That's my philosophy in life. <laughs> don't eat things that look like poop, apparently. Unless it doesn't taste like it. <laughs> Guys, it is now the next morning and I just want to thank you very much for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you give it a like and subscribe 
and tell some other people about this channel if you if you are enjoying it that is and uh, we will see you tomorrow okay guys high five